Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to fast food restaurants and ordering the least popular menu item. I'm excited. I've always wondered what the grossest thing is from a fast food place that no one wants but is still on the menu for years. So today we're going to find out. Let's get started. And before we start, be sure to smash the like button and subscribe for more videos. So the first place we're going is Dunkin' Donuts. Just curious, what's like your least popular drink? Got the goods and the employees were so nice. I swear they were trying to sell me the whole menu, but we have an iced Americano, blueberry muffin, and an egg white veggie omelet. Let's start with the Americano because I hate coffee. I don't even know what's in this. Like what's the difference between all the different types of coffees? Also, this smells very bad. I'm scared. Mm, mm, mm. <laughs> Not even being over dramatic. This is disgusting. It's so strong. I feel like I'm eating coffee beans straight up. I don't get how anyone actually enjoys coffee. I feel like you have to be a psychopath. This is somehow worse than the Starbucks drinks I had a few weeks ago. I'm giving it a 0 out of 10. Next up, we got the blueberry muffin. This is one of my favorite kinds of muffins. I'm excited. I love how there's sugar on top and there's a very light blueberry smell. First bite. Mmm, now this is good. This slaps. It has a perfect level of sweetness and I love the crunch on top from the sugar. Also, it's not very dry or artificial, which is surprising. Super fluffy. I love this. I'll definitely be finishing this after the video. I'm giving it a 10 out of 10. Good job, Duncan. Seriously though, why are blueberry muffins so good? Mm. Lastly, we got the veggie egg white omelet, which I'm not excited about because I hate eggs. It looks very sad and there's cheese on this, which sucks because I'm not a big fan of cheese. Yeah, this is not good. It does not have any flavor. All I can taste is the peppers and I don't like this bun thing on it. It's too seedy for me. I'll give it a four out of 10 because it's not the most horrible thing I've eaten in my life. Stop number two is McDonald's and their least popular menu item is the filet fish I hate fish in general and definitely don't trust fish from a fast food restaurant, so lucky me. This looks disgusting and the fact that there's cheese on this feels so wrong. Also, why does a fish look like a hash brown? That should be illegal. Pray for me. Three, two, one. Oh my god. Nope, nope, nope. It tastes very soggy and the sauce on it is very sour. It has a super fishy taste, which I hate. This is as horrible as it sounds. The best part about it is the bun. Zero out of ten. I would rather drink the coffee and that says a lot. Next stop is Taco Bell. And again, I'm going to have to ask the employees what the least ordered thing is. Got the Taco Bell and it was so embarrassing because I ran over a curb while in the drive through line and the lady was laughing at me. So that's great. She said a lot of people don't order the cheesy roll up and the bean burrito. Also, I'm astonished that this only costs $2.50. That does not sound right. Let's start with the bean burrito and this is very floppy. I don't even know what's in this, but I'm not a fan of burritos because it's too much tortilla for me, but let's give it a try. I'm splitting it in the middle to give it a fair chance. This is my worst nightmare. This does not smell good and it looks like vomit. Can't wait. Not horrible. Mmm. The beans are actually good because it's like refined beans, which is my favorite type of bean. But I do think there is way too much tortilla. It's very overpowering. It's also super messy and I would not order this again, but I will eat a few more bites, so I'll give it a 6 out of 10. I feel like this could be really good if they added some pizzazz, like some tomatoes. Yum. Now we got the cheesy roll-up, which just looks like the Walmart version of the quesadilla. Not the biggest fan of cheese either, but let's try it. Ew. This just tastes sad. I guess people get this if they don't want a full-size quesadilla. I wish the tortilla was toasted, though. It would be really good. I'll give it a 7 out of 10. Would never get again, but I guess I'll finish it since I paid for it. All right, it's been a few hours, but I'm back. I had to go back to my mom's house. Divorce pants things. Anyway, stop number four is Wendy's, so let's see what we get. Just curious, what is like your least popular food item? Number nine is barbecue chicken cheeseburger. Secure the bag. We got the chili and the bourbon burger. Let's start with the chili, and this does not look safe to eat. First bite, cheers. Wait, this slaps. Mmm. I actually really like it. It tastes like the pasta sauce that my grandma used to make. Rest in peace, Ita. Love you, girl. It's super flavorful. It's just very off-putting because I read that this is just old, expired, dry hamburgers from the grill. But I'm just going to ignore this because this is incredible. Mmm. Super underrated. Definitely recommend this. I'll give it a 9 out of 10. Now we got the bourbon cheeseburger, and this looks like diabetes. There's fried onions on it. But I'm not going to judge a book by its cover. Let's try it. Not a fan. This is so gross. Why is it on the menu? Their bourbon sauce is very sweet and the burger patty is dry. The only part I like is the bacon. 
super crunchy. It tastes like cardboard. I was expecting way more. I'm super disappointed. I definitely understand why this is not a popular choice on the menu. I'm giving it a 4 out of 10. So that's Wendy's and now I really want ice cream so I'm going to Cold Stone. My Cold Stone order is the peanut butter cup perfection. It's chef's kiss. But I'm crossing my fingers and hoping that we get something good. Got the Cold Stone. I freaked out because someone that I knew from high school worked there. It was too awkward to ask him what the least popular flavor is so I just got the flavor that looked like it had the most in the tub thing. And the flavor I got is banana. Love banana bread, love banana pudding, but I'm not sure how I feel about this. I hate fruit flavored ice cream like mango and strawberry, so I don't think I'm gonna like this, but let's try it anyway. It smells kind of good. Wait. I misjudged this, this slaps. I'm in heaven, this rocks. It tastes exactly like the Magnolia Bakery banana pudding, which I've been missing. So who knew that I could have just come to Cold Stone and had it. It's delicious and creamy. I'm giving it a 9 out of 10 only because if I got a mix in, this would have been on the next level. All right, guys, that's going to wrap up the video. Thank you so much for watching. This was an interesting day and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.